Hello everyone, I am your science teacher Himrita Chandulia. Students, today we are going to complete chapter number 4 of class 7 science that is heat. Students, in our videos of this chapter, we had discussed about what is heat, sources of heat and the basic differences between heat and temperature and we also read about or discuss about the degree of hotness and coldness that is temperature and the devices which are used for the measurement of temperature. We discussed about clinical and laboratory thermometer and after that we discussed about the transfer of heat by three ways conduction, convection and radiation. So, students today we are going to discuss the exercise section of this chapter. Let us begin with the question number 1 students. Question number 1 is state similarities and differences between the laboratory thermometer and clinical thermometer. Okay, You got it the question students. The question is state similarities and differences. So, we have to write down similarity first and after that we will write differences between clinical and laboratory thermometer. Okay, First, what are the similarities beta? Both the clinical thermometer and laboratory thermometer have the same thermometric fluid that is mercury. Both are made of glass, isn't it? So, we have to write both clinical and laboratory thermometers have long, narrow, uniform glass tubes. Okay? And second, subse important point the bulb of both the thermometers have mercury in them. Is that clear? Let us begin with differences. Beta, what are the major differences? First difference is that dono ka use alag alag hai. We are using clinical thermometer for measuring the human body temperature and clinical uh, and laboratory thermometer is used for laboratory purposes. We are using it in science laboratories, isn't it? And second subse important, they both have the ranges, different different ranges. Okay? So, we will write clinical thermometer is used to measure the temperature of a human body. However, laboratory thermometer cannot be used to measure the temperature of a human body. Okay? Its purpose is different. Okay? The temperature range of clinical thermometer, yes, again it is very important. The, temp the temperature range, it is of between 35 degree Celsius to 42 degree Celsius. Kiska? Clinical thermometer ka, okay. And what is the range of laboratory thermometer? While that laboratory thermometer is from minus 10 degree Celsius to 110 degree Celsius. Is it clear to everyone? What are the other differences? For next one is the least count of both the thermometers differs of course. In dono ke jo least counts hai wo bhi differ karte hai. Fine? Ab next one unlike clinical thermometer that can be tilted. Yes, hum clinical thermometer may measurement of temperature ko dekhne ke liye values ko dekhne ke liye usko tilt kar sakte hain. But in laboratory thermometer, we always have to keep the thermometer upright, bilkul straight rakhna padta hai. And it should be surrounded with the that particular substances whose temperature we have to measure. Okay, students, so we have to write laboratory thermometer is kept upright while reading the temperature values. Okay, class 7th, is it clear? In this way, you have to write the similarities and differences. Okay, proceed on the next question. Give two examples each of conductors and insulators of heat. Hame dono ke examples dene hai and it's very easy question. We know what are the examples of the good conductors or the conductors of heat are aluminium, iron. Yes, you can also write other metals also. You can write the copper, fine student or many more if you know. Okay, But at least you have to give two examples. Okay, Two examples of insulators. We know that insulator. What is insulator? 
plastic is insulator you can also write rubber fine sometimes we write uh, glass tubes also ok students come on on the next question fill in the blanks the easiest one agar hume option hote to aur bhi easy hota chaliye koi nahi the hotness of an object is determined by its yes hum kisi bhi object ka hotness and coolness kis se measure karte hain yes it 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 is temperature to write down temperature fine agar question aapse coolness bhi pucha hai then the answer is same it is temperature next one the temperature of boiling water cannot be measured by which thermometer yes it cannot be measured by clinical thermometer write down clinical fine ok the next one temperature is measured in degree yes in degree celsius so write down celsius fine class 7 the next one no medium is required for transfer of heat by the process of yes kaun se way me hume zarurat nahi padti medium ki no medium it is radiation write down radiation fine students let's proceed with the next a cold steel spoon is dipped in a cup of hot milk ok heat is transferred to its other end by the process of yes ab yaha hum se poochha ja raha hai ki hot cup of milk hai in which we dipped a cold steel spoon ok ab us mein jo heat ka transfer hooga it is by which process yes it is by conduction isn't it so write down conduction ok next one clothes of dash colors absorb more heat better than clothes of light colors yes which color clothes are the good absorber of heat they are dark ok so write down dark ok come on on next question students what is our next question match the following we have to match this column to this column and again i am just repeating myself you do not have to write zig zag zig zag you have to write the correct answer in front of it ok let us read one land breeze blows during which time remember that in conviction we uh, learnt about it land breeze blows during night time ok sea breeze blows during day time ok so match it with day the next one dark colored clothes are preferred during yes kab prefer kerte hain hum dark clothes ko pehna during winter season because they are good absorber of heat aur sardiyon mein hume heat ki zyada zarurat hoti hai ok light colored clothes are preferred during yes kaun se time summers mein because they are good reflectors ye heat ko reflect karte hain fine students ok come on on the next one discuss why wearing more layers of clothing during winters keep us warmer than wearing a just thick piece of clothing yes we discussed in our chapter hum sardiyo mein layer pe layer pehanna zyada prefer karte hain bajaye iske ki we can, we have to wear a thick layer of uh, any cloth okay so what we have to write we have to write during winters we prefer wearing more layers of clothing than just one thick piece of clothing why because air gets trapped in between the various clothing layers and we know air is a poor conductor of heat ok students so students we will write being a poor conductor of heat air prevents 
हीट लॉस फ्रॉम आर बॉडी फाइन इसलिए एयर इज अ पुअर कंडक्टर हैंस लेयर ऑफ क्लोदिंग कीप्स अस वार्मर दैन अ थिक लेयर ऑफ क्लोदिंग ओके दैन अ थिक लेयर और दैन अ सिंगल लेयर ओके स्टूडेंट्स लेट्स कम ऑन ऑन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज लुक एट द फिगर mark where heat is being transferred by conduction by convection and by radiation students uh, just have a look on this diagram you have to indicate or you have to write ki by which processes kahan kahan radiation hai kahan kahan convection hai kahan uh, kya bolte hain conduction hai you have to write that or you have to indicate that beta just have a look yahan burner uh, burner is on From burner to the pan, ये जो container है जिसमें हमारे पास water है यहाँ से यहाँ heat का transfer it is done by radiation, okay? It is done by radiation, okay बेटा And from pan to water, water is inside, so from pan to water it is done by conduction. so we can write it is done by conduction okay and ab within water ek sath to pani garam nahi hota hai na to within water heat transfer by yes within water it is by convection fine class 7th radiation conduction and convection so you can write it also we will write transfer of heat from burner to pan is by radiation okay and transfer of heat from pan to water is by conduction and within water the transfer of water, uh, heat within water is by convection so i hope it is clear to everyone come on in next question class next question is in place of hot climate it is advised that आउटर वॉल्स ऑफ हाउसेज बी पेंटेड वाइट येस जहाँ पर हॉट क्लाइमेट होता है उन घरों की जो आउटर वॉल्स होती हैं वी सजेस्ट दैट कि उनका जो पेंट होना चाहिए वो वाइट होना चाहिए वाई येस बिकॉज वाइट इज अ गुड रिफ्लैक्ट फाइन सो इन प्लेसेज ऑफ हॉट क्लाइमेट इट इज एडवाइज टू पेंट आउटर वॉल ऑफ हाउसेज एज वाइट because light color such as white reflects back most of the heat that falls on it and hence a light color tends to keep the house cool fine light colors aapko uh, ek cool feeling dete hain wo sabse zyada light ko reflect karte hain a light reflect hoti hai that mean heat ka absorption sabse kam hua hai fine come on on the next one One liter of water at thirty degrees Celsius is mixed with one liter of water at fifty degrees Celsius. The temperature of the mixture will be yes. It's very good question. Yes, it is very interesting also. आपके पास one liter thirty degrees Celsius water था, fifty degrees Celsius one liter water था. You mix both the water. Fine. अब ये पूछ रहे हैं the temperature of the mixture will be. Is it? 80 degree Celsius, more than 50 degree Celsius, but less than 80 degree Celsius. It should be 20 degree Celsius or between 30 degree Celsius or 50 degree Celsius. Remember, कीजिए हमारा activity that we had done. We put our left hand in hot, right hand in cold, and after that we put our both the hands in that. container which is having the mixture of a and b the normal tap water isn't it so the answer kya hoga ki unka temperature in dono ke beech ka hoga so you have to write the temperature should be will be between 30 degree celsius and 50 degree celsius fine class 7 come on on next next one is an iron ball at 40 degree celsius okay is dropped in a mug containing water at 40 degree celsius uska temperature 40 degree celsius jisme drop hua that container is 40 degree celsius having temperature of water theek hai 
so the heat will be flow from iron ball to water not flow from iron ball to water or flow or from water to iron ball flow from water to iron ball increase the temperature of both beta remember humne ek baat kahi thi ki transfer of heat do objects ke beech mein tab tak hota hai jab tak equilibrium condition nahi aati hai equilibrium condition ka matlab hota hai ki both the bodies acquire the same temperature beta if it is having 40 degree celsius and the mug uh, the water in the mug is having 40 degree celsius that means there will be no transfer of heat fine so which option is uh, matching with our answer not flow from iron ball to water or from water to iron ball fine class 7th kyunki dono ka temperature kya hai same hai aur humne kya padha hai transfer of heat is from hotter to colder one isn't it so come on next one a wooden spoon is dipped in a cup of ice cream okay its other and becomes cold by the process of conduction okay uska ek and ab ya to thanda ho jayega by conduction process because it is dipped in ice cream becomes cold by the process of conviction theek hai ab solid hai to conviction hona hai kya becomes cooled by the process of radiation does not become cold yes it will does not become cold because it is a wooden spoon beta and wooden spoon is a insulator it is a poor conductor or the bad conductor of heat or cold whatever the condition we are having nahi hoga thanda fine so it is a insulator so does not become cold you can do that because nowadays you are having ice creams uh, it is little bit summer and monsoon okay so you can just cross tally by practical okay come on on next one class stainless steel pan are usually provided with copper bottom yes hamare ghar mein kuch utensils aise honge jinke niche copper base hoga the reason for this could be that yes what is the reason behind that copper bottom makes the pan more durable ठीक है वो उसको ज़्यादा ड्यूरेबल बना देते हैं इसलिए हम लगाते हैं सच पैंस अपीयर कलरफुल ओके कॉपर इज बैटर कंडक्टर ऑफ हीट देन द स्टेनलेस स्टील ओके द लास्ट वन कॉपर इज इजियर टू क्लीन दैन द स्टेनलेस स्टील तो इससे हमारा कोई लेना देना नहीं है क्या वो उसको ड्यूरेबल बनाता है हाँ बनाता होगा इफ यू आर गिविंग द टू कोटिंग द थिंग बिकम द ड्यूरेबल बट हमारा आंसर क्या है कि हम क्यों उसको यूजली यूज करते हैं क्यों दिया जाता है तो ड्यूरेबिलिटी इज नॉट द रीजन हेयर सच पैंस अपियर कलरफुल ओके ठीक है कॉपर इज बैटर कंडक्टर ऑफ ही दैन स्टीनलेस स्टील यस दिस इज द आंसर कॉपर इज बैटर कंडक्टर ऑफ हीट वो ज़्यादा जल्दी हीट को ट्रांसफ़र करता है फ्राम बर्नर टू बर्नर टू दैट फूड दैट इज कैप्ट इन दैट कॉपर कंटेनर फाइन सो स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस वे ऑल द क्वेश्चन आंसर्स ऑफ एक्सरसाइज सेक्शन कंप्लीट से राइट डाउन ऑल द क्वेश्चन आंसर्स इन योर साइंस नोटबुक एंड लर्न दैम ओके स्टूडेंट्स इन वेरी सून वी विल मीट अगेन इन आर नेक्स्ट वीडियो टिल देन Take care thank you everyone